Captain Booty bringing you a little bit of gameplay. Uh, yeah. What is that cruiser doing? Looks like he's just running straight out in the middle of a bunch of the red. Well, oh well. Some people you can help, some people you can't. Uh, I like playing destroyers a lot. Man, that should have hit. Uh, took take another look. Nope. But guess what? Torpedoes hit. As Baron would say, torpedoes. A couple shots here. This little destroyer I'm on, it's the one that uh, we had in the following uh, video. Or in the video before this one. Ow! That one hurt. And uh, it's the Mikaze. And I just love this little thing. It's fun to play. Got a few torpedoes out on this guy, but yeah, he ain't going to hit nothing there. Take a couple pop shots at a cruiser. Got a little bit. Jew. Okay, now. Everybody's after the booty, but you can't have the booty. Ah! I hate getting my engine knocked out. I tell you, it's one of the worst things to have in a destroyer is have your engine knocked out. Popped a little bit of smoke there. And I tell you, um, if you don't use very much smoke, you need to start if you're playing a destroyer. Um, very crucial. Believe me, because the less you're seen, the better off you are. You can scoot and boot and uh, just stay off the radar, so to speak. And I usually wait. I said most of the time, usually wait until they get uh, entangled with the bigger ship before I start blasting them. Oh, they're after the booty again. But you can't have it. Ain't giving it up. Some more torpedoes coming in, as Baron would say. We can outrun those pretty easy. Get back on this cruiser. Now you noticed right here I didn't shoot right in the aiming area. Now because the reason why I was anticipating this guy to um, be slowing down. A. For my torpedoes. And B. Because there was another destroyer coming at him. So he was either going to dodge or... And I'm thinking I was getting ready to miss, but... Got him. Zero! Boom! He's dead. We're running six to five right now. Now... Everybody's firing at me. This is one thing in a destroyer. Keep it zigzagging as much as possible. Sometimes if I'm trying to get lined up on shots and I get lined up and uh, I'll just continue to zigzag back and forth, back and forth, back and forth. I mean real fast. And that throws the aim off dramatically on these guys. Um... Because you don't have no armor. I mean, 
Gee whiz, I got 10,900 points here. One good volley from a any uh, battleship would take me out. Two good volleys from a, a cruiser would take me out. A torpedo, just one single torpedo would take me out. Most likely. Fire a couple of shots over here into that inlet where they're getting ready to come out. Let everything cool down. Let my smoke hide me. And I noticed that we're being captured right now. And I figure it's that destroyer on that was sneaking up on the backside over there between us, between their cap and our cap. Uh, he's on pretty much full health. I'm down to half. I don't remember what class he was at the moment or during the battle for that. But I also noticed that we're still up one and which doesn't mean nothing really. I mean, it helps, but that can change in a matter of seconds. Believe me. You can have one of those guys rush someone and not go well for him but I'm just sitting here waiting and looking looking there he is as soon as I get him in my sights he pops smoke disappears I take a blind shot reset cap got a hit I'm thinking about cruising around this uh, the island we got here this will help keep me uh, under cover and also probably take him off his radar there he is I'll take a couple more blind shots while I see the smoke coming out didn't hit nothing knows he fired some torpedoes so I fired them in the general direction where the torpedoes came from kind of blanket that whole area hoping to get a hit and as the torpedoes are going in sorry I had to get a drink there um, I decided to go amongst them and I'm getting into the cap circle and I'm thinking he's on my left side. Yep, there's the torpedoes. He couldn't see me yet, but he he thought I was around there. We're eight to seven now, and I know you can't see it because of my logo, but he's about to cap I get a good hit on him just one I thought about getting torpedoes but decided not to because he's getting ready to fire some get a couple more hits on him and I decided to take him out of the game before he could take me out so a nice little ram there So besides exiting the game right now, I decided to go over and watch our Fuso in this battle take place on the rest of the game. And he's on good health. I feel confident we're going to win this game. He's got an Omaha against him, which is not a big problem and a carrier. Um, carrier shot his torpedoes. Got 
destroyer on pretty good health over there. Like I said, not worried about it. I think we got this one in the bag. And then Fuso eyes. Boom, boom, boom. The aircraft carrier. <laughs> he just got some torpedoes. And I'm assuming that this guy has been playing Havoc with the Fuso during all this game. Because from this point on, the Fuso only has eyes for the carrier pretty much. He throws a few, sh a few shots over there to the uh, cruiser, the Omaha. But as you can tell, he's going to take a left hand turn here trying to intercept that carrier now something that you don't know as of right now because you can't see it on screen but he will end up shooting down 15 planes of this carrier As our other uh, uh -oh, our destroyers down to almost no health. Omaha still trying to take out the Fuso. But he still just focuses mainly on the carrier. Now the carrier is went out of sight for right now so he decides to put a few rounds over into Omaha but our other battleship and our destroyer are kind of lagging back there in the smoke and there come some more torpedoes boom boom couple more hits kind of angles himself toward the cruiser up there Omaha so the damage would be minimal but then he notices you got it full speed ramming speed ahead he's going to try to ram that carrier And you know, I'm thinking at this moment. No, don't do that. Just shoot him. But and I, then I said, well, hell, I did it won't go. Might as well do it. Omaha lost his life back there. They took him out. making corrections and boom we won the game right there had two kills 16 uh, shots two petite torpedo hits two or three and three flooding Oh, that's from uh, ramming. But look at the damage done, and I was surprised. <laughs> I came out with high damage here. Not a bad game. It was fun. You know, I'm kind of wishy-washy whether I should have rammed that guy or not. Of course, I went ahead and did it. Right there, it got me 9,000 plus hit points on the RAM. 
So six thousand one hundred traded out for I think nine thousand seven hundred. Ain't a bad trade off. And like I said, I always say guys, thank you for watching. Please like and share and subscribe. It helps out the channel. Uh, see you out on the seven seas. Thank y'all. Thank <laughs> you.